Let us offer higher education as our war memorial. To honor those who took part in the great war. To the glory of those gallant fighters who came through. And to the memory of those devoted heroes who gave their lives in the cause of freedom. Now, every material asset a person possesses may flee. Education alone is an asset of which an individual cannot be robbed. The University of Leicester, educating and inspiring for a century. Our first two years at Leicester from 1960 were involved in studying X-radiation from the sun. Our priorities changed dramatically in 1962 with the discovery of a bright source in the night sky. For the following few years we flew rockets from Australia and found more than a dozen of these strange nighttime X-ray sources. To find out what they were, we really needed a satellite and then Ariel 5 came along and gave us that opportunity and we were fortunate to find an incredibly bright source, the brightest ever seen, which subsequent observations have found to be a very good candidate of a stellar black hole. I was invited as a human osteologist to come down and get involved with a project that was looking for Richard, but was probably going to unearth the remains of a medieval friary. The thing that I think this project taught me more than anything else was about the humanity of Richard III. And what finding his skeleton let us do was to realize just how much more complicated the reality really is. When you're an archeologist, your work isn't always self-evidently exciting to the public but this gave me a real opportunity to work on something that people genuinely connected with, people genuinely wanted to know about, and that was a really rewarding experience. I came to Leicester in 1977 and just fell in love with the place. It was that atmosphere of complete academic freedom. The biggest breakthroughs in science are those that come completely unexpected. DNA fingerprint is a very good case in point. Science tries to get it right all too often gets it wrong. Your job is to try and sort it out. It was after a lot of false starts, completely by accident, we came up with our very first DNA fingerprint. So that was on the 10th of September, 1984. And that was a moment that changed my life. Our work is dedicated to discovering new ways of responding to hate crime. We live in a world where, sadly, levels of hate crime are escalating year in, year out. And what we do is that we try to provide the evidence to help those agencies respond more effectively to victims of hate crime. To discover everything that we possibly can about their experiences of hate crime, the emotional and physical harms of hate, and what they want to see in terms of a response to hate crime. So for me, that's the only way of ensuring that our research can genuinely make a difference.
Welcome to the University of Leicester Summer Degree Ceremonies for the College of Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities. The ceremony will begin when the academic procession enters the hall. Guests are permitted to take photos and videos, but are kindly asked to remain in their seats throughout the ceremony. Please ensure that any smart devices are in silent mode. You can share your photos and videos on social media using the hashtag LeicesterGrad. We hope you enjoy the ceremony, and on behalf of the University of Leicester family, a huge congratulations to our class of 2022. If you do not wish to shake hands with the presiding officer, please hold your brochure in your hand as you cross the stage. Please stand for the academic procession.
Professor Nishan Kanagaraja, President and Vice-Chancellor, will now open the ceremony. As President and Vice-Chancellor of the University, and by the authority of the Senate and the Council, I declare this congregation open for the conferring of degrees on candidates both present and absent. Please be seated. Graduates, distinguished guests, my university colleagues, a warm welcome to you to our summer graduation ceremony. Welcome also to those watching online around the campus or indeed anywhere in the world. This is a memorable occasion in many respects and for none more so than you and your loved ones. What you have achieved is truly remarkable. We have lived through one of the most tumultuous periods in our history, a global pandemic that has changed the world before our very eyes. You have proven yourselves to be adaptable and resilient as you coped with sudden change, lockdown, hybrid learning, and sadly, too often dealing with pain and loss. The applause you received today is richly deserved. You take with you more than a degree certificate and new letters after your name. In this, our centenary year, we recall the words of one of our founding fathers, Dr. Hasley Clark, who said, every material asset a person possesses may flee. Education alone is another asset of which an individual cannot be robbed. I look forward to congratulating you on your wonderful achievements on stage. President and Vice-Chancellor, on behalf of the College of Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities, I, Professor Chris Wilkins, present the following candidates for their degrees. Natasha Bailey. Well Susan Bishop. Jack Chokwey. Congratulations, Jack. Well done. Jihad Drari. Congratulations. Well done. Elizabeth Jones. Congratulations, Elizabeth. Well done. Jennifer Kemp. Not this one. Congratulations, Jennifer. Well done. Shada Maharaj Ramjatam. Joshua McBellan. Bradley Phipps. Alexander Powell. Congratulations, Alexander. Well done. And David Yates. Congratulations, David. Well done.
for the degree of Doctor of Education, Paramal Mukesh Bhatt. For the degree of Master of Research in History, Judith Please. Somek. Congratulations. Well done. For the degree of Master of Arts in Applied Linguistics and TESOL, Brittini Madge Guero. Well done. Congratulations. Andrea Ravayova. Congratulations, Andrea. Well done. For the degree of Master of Arts in Diplomatic Studies, Rita Phillip. Congratulations, Rita. Well done. And Mushtaq Hussein Mughal. Congratulations, Mushtaq. For the degree of Master of Arts in English, Local History and Family History, Denise Greeny. Well done, Denise. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in History, Local History, Sarah Cooley. Congratulations, Sarah. Well done. For the degree of Master of Arts in Human Rights and Global Ethics, Barbara Chisnikowska. Congratulations, Barbara. Well done. Ashleen McNally. Congratulations, Ashleen. Well done. Johnson and Wangi. Well done, Johnson. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in Intelligence and Security, Mohammed Ali. Congratulations, Mohammed. Well done. Julius Sidonis. Well done, Julius. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in International Education, Romina Ashik. Congratulations, Romina. Well done. Haley Briggs. Well done, Haley. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in International Education, Innovation and Reform, Aisha Goni. Congratulations. Epan. Congratulations. Well done. For the degree of Master of Arts in International Education, Leadership for Social Justice in Education, Maria Chowdhury. Congratulations, Maria. For the degree of Master of Arts in International Education Pedagogy, Blessing Agu. Congratulations, Lucy. Well done. Belinda Easter de Silva. Congratulations, Belinda. Well done. Zing Yang Fan. Well done, Zing Yang. Well done. For the degree of Master of Arts in International Security Studies, Peter Tate. Well done, Peter. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in Politics of Conflict and Violence, Nagina Estanaskai Zarifa. Well done, Nagina. Congratulations. Willow Rose. Well done. And Jack Waterman. Well done, Jack. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in Security, Conflict and International Development, Sharon Ayani. Well done, Sharon. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Arts in T-Cell, Marina Hilimindri. Well done, Marina. Congratulations. For the degree of Master of Science in Educational Leadership, 
Alberta Bojea. Congratulations, Alberta. Well done. Melanie Camilleri. Well done, Melanie. Whitney Cremona. Congratulations, Whitney. Tanya Formosa. Congratulations, Tanya. Well done. And Rebecca Singleton. Congratulations, Rebecca. For the postgraduate diploma in international relations and world honor, Mohamed Niazi. Congratulations, Mohamed. Well done. For the degree of postgraduate certificate in education, primary, Mojisola Amole. Congratulations, Mojisola. Well done. Georgia Battersby. Congratulations, Georgia. Well done. Zain Habib Bojani. Congratulations, Zain. Well done. Elana Bishop. Well done, Elana. Congratulations. Nasha Blakemore. Congratulations, Nasha. Well done. Lauren Bowbank. Well done, Lauren. Congratulations. Verity Burton. Congratulations, Verity. Well done. Radhika Chavda. Congratulations, Radhika. Well done. Samuel Dilks. Well done, Samuel. Congratulations. Ekta Dinesh Chandra. Well done. Congratulations. Maria Edwards. Well done, Maria. Congratulations. Chanel Gamble. Congratulations, Chanel. Well done. Nimco Golongol. Congratulations, Nimco. Well done. Gina Guerrero. Congratulations, Gina. Well done. Rhiannon Halfpenny. Well done, Rhiannon. Congratulations. Aisha Hamed. Congratulations, Aisha. Well done. Lauren Harvey. Well done, Lauren. Congratulations. Aisha Hassan. Congratulations, Aisha. Brittany Hine. Well done, Brittany. Congratulations. Emma Holland. Well done, Emma. Congratulations. Ali Inman. Well done, Ali. Congratulations. Holly Jackson. Well done, Holly. Congratulations. Tilly Kirkpatrick Kroll. Well done, Tilly. Congratulations. Megan Lewis. Congratulations, Megan. Well done. Leanne McKee. Well done, Leanne. Congratulations. Lauren Newton. Congratulations, Lauren. Well done. Natasha Nichols. Well done, Natasha. Congratulations. Isabel Orton. Congratulations, Isabel. Daisy Palmer. Congratulations, Daisy. Kajul Patel. Congratulations, well done, Isabel. 
Lucy Peters. Congratulations, Lucy. Well done. Natalie Powell. Well done, Natalie. Congratulations. Surabjit Raka. Congratulations, Surabjit. Well done. Yusra Rashid. Congratulations, Yusra. Abigail Richards. Congratulations, Abigail. Well done. Shreya Sivadia. Congratulations, Shreya. Well done. Ranel Serrano. Congratulations, Ranel. Well done. Gopi Shah. Congratulations, Gopi. Well done. Matthew Talbot. Well done, Matthew. Congratulations. Alia Uma. Congratulations, well done. Chloe Wheatley. Well done, Chloe. Congratulations. And Lauren Williams. Congratulations, Lauren. Well done. For the degree, a postgraduate certificate in education, Skate, Fatima Abbas Ali Raza. Congratulations, Fatima. Maria Ajiz. Congratulations, Maria. Well done. Zainab Amir. Congratulations, Zainab. Well done. Olivia Balchen. Well done, Olivia. Congratulations. Vicky Blunt. Well done, Vicky. Congratulations. Lauren Bracey. Congratulations, Lauren. Aidan Brant Hall. Congratulations, Aidan. Well done. Thomas Briley. Congratulations, Thomas. Well done. Timothy Brown. Congratulations, Timothy. Shannon Burgess. Well done, Shannon. Congratulations. Kerry Carmichael. Congratulations, Kerry. Well done. Patience Chikaponya. Congratulations, Patience. <laughs> Emily Collier. Congratulations, Emily. Well done. Jenny Daffern. Well done, Jenny. Congratulations. Jody Donahue. Well done, Jody. Congratulations. Haley Fieldsend. Well done, Haley. Congratulations. Cleopatra Gifford. Congratulations, Cleopatra. Well done. Chloe Hargreaves. Well done, Chloe. Congratulations. Laura Harris. Well done, Laura. Congratulations. Elizabeth Hill. Well done, Elizabeth. Congratulations. Jack Hillman. Well done, Jack. Congratulations. Mariam Ibrahim. Congratulations, Mariam. Well done. Rola Jawad. Well done, congratulations. 
Celeste Jennings. Well done, fellas. Congratulations. Emily Jones. Well done, Emily. Congratulations. Amy Jordan. Congratulations, Amy. Well done. Louise Cachella. Well done, Louise. Congratulations. Hafsa Khalifa. Congratulations, well done. Elizabeth Knight. Well done, Elizabeth. Congratulations. Amanpreet Kuna. Congratulations, well done. Katie Lamb. Well done, Katie. Congratulations. Erin Leahy. Well done, congratulations. Sam Lee. Well done, Sam. Congratulations. Lucinda Lehal. Congratulations, Lucinda. Well done. Sarah Livesey Barnes. Well done, Sarah. Congratulations. Henna Malik. Congratulations. Holly May. Well done, Holly. Congratulations. Kaylee McKinnon. Congratulations, Kaylee. Well done. Erin Mailer. Well done, Erin. Congratulations. Lisa Mitchell. Well done, Lisa. Congratulations. Kirsty Moore. Well done, Kirsty. Congratulations. Imogen Newby. Well done, Imogen. Congratulations. Callum Popworth. Well done, congratulations. Richard Parr. Well done, Richard. Congratulations. Sajal Patel. Congratulations, Sajal. Well done. Sumaya Patel. Well done, Sumaya. Congratulations. And Harad Salter. Well done. Congratulations. Sharifa Sarang. Congratulations, Sharifa. Well done. Justine Singh. Congratulations, Justine. Well done. Bethany Smyton. Congratulations, Bethany. Well done. Charlotte Sparling Haythornthwaite. Well done, Charlotte. Congratulations. Rebecca Stabick. Well done, Rebecca. Congratulations. Alan Stevens. Congratulations, Alan. Well done. Arusa Tahir. Congratulations. Congratulations. Rinsi Valia Parambil. Well done. Congratulations, Rinsi. Fidelsa Wari. Natalie Watkins. Well done, Natalie. Congratulations. Emily White. 
Well done, Emily. Congratulations. Jack Whitmore. Well done, Jack. Congratulations. Emily Wildman. Well done, Emily. Congratulations. And Charlie Woodley. Congratulations, Charlie. Well done. For the degree of Postgraduate Certificate in Education, Secondary, Jessica Banks. Well done, Jessica. Congratulations. Amina Begum. Congratulations, Amina. Munira Bailey. Congratulations, Munira. Well done. Elizabeth Brocklehurst. Well done, Elizabeth. Congratulations. Jade Burton. Congratulations, Jade. Well done. Avia Butt. Congratulations, Avia. Well done. Holly Button. Congratulations, Holly. Well done. Reese Campbell. Well done, Reese. Congratulations. Kieran Cawley. Congratulations, well done, Kieran. Milos Halpecki. Congratulations, Milos. Well done. Natasha Christou Kuna. Congratulations, Natasha. Chloe Cook. Well done, Chloe. Congratulations. Imogen Creswell. Well done, Imogen. Congratulations. Sina Essex. Congratulations, Sina. Well done. Seth Goddard. Well done, Seth. Congratulations. Alfie Hollingsworth. Well done, Alfie. Congratulations. Charlie Holmes. Well done, Charlie. Congratulations. Zainab Iqbal. Congratulations, Zainab. Well done. Bavini Jivan. Congratulations, well done. Mohammed Khan. Kushi Lad. Congratulations, well done. Nishta Limbachia. Congratulations, Nishta, well done. Falguni Mahesh. Congratulations, Madeline. Well done. Kathleen Marson. Congratulations, Kathleen. Well done. William Main. Well done, William. Congratulations. Patrick Montgomery. Congratulations, Patrick. Hanan Musalam. Congratulations. Kiran Mushtaq. Congratulations, well done. Amira Natalia. Congratulations, Amira, well done. Max Newman. Well done, Max. Congratulations. Zoe O'Donnell. Congratulations, Zoe. Well done. 
Figen Oserek. Congratulations, well done. Freddie Player. Well done, Freddie, congratulations. Zainab Seder. Congratulations, well done. Olivia Scarf. Well done, Olivia. Congratulations. Adil Sheikh. Congratulations, Adil. Well done. Eve Stannard. Congratulations, Eve. Well done. Tom Sturty Vant. Well done, Tom. Congratulations. Yashna Taylor. Congratulations, Yashna. Well done. Alexia Tano. Congratulations, Alexia. Well done. Christopher Thompson. Well done, Christopher. Congratulations. Javier Tour. Well done, congratulations. Olivia Tulloch. Congratulations, Olivia. Well done. Aaron Waite. Congratulations, Aaron. Well done. Emily Wilson. Congratulations, Emily. Well done. And Olivia Wilson. Well done, Olivia. Congratulations. For the Postgraduate Certificate in International Security Studies, Ebtahel Mansur. Congratulations, well done. For the degree of Professional Graduate Certificate in Education Primary, Harmon Gill. Congratulations, well done. Tegan Jessica Goodedge. Congratulations, Kate. Well done. Lucy Pendlebury. Congratulations, Lucy. Well done. Rebecca Robbins. Well done, Rebecca. Congratulations. Safiya Tayob. Well done, Safiya. Congratulations. Jay Vaja. Well done, Jay. Congratulations. And Karen Warwick. Congratulations, Karen. Well done. For the degree of Professional Graduate Certificate in Education, Skit, Georgia Hall. Well done, Georgia. Congratulations. Mohammed Harun. Well done, Mohammed. Congratulations. Amara Iqbal. Congratulations, Amara. Well done. Sarah O'Donnell. Well done, Sarah. Congratulations. Safira Patel. Congratulations. Well done. And for the degree of Professional Graduate Certificate in Education Secondary, Amy Hutchinson. Congratulations, Amy. Well done. Mr. President and Vice-Chancellor, may I present Constance Ensungie Ejuma, a candidate for the honorary degree of Doctor of Letters. Constance Ejuma is an actor, film producer, and writer. 
She was born to a family that hails from the southwestern English-speaking part of Cameroon and spent her formative years there before moving to Washington, D.C. She studied theater at the University of Toronto before coming to Leicester, where she graduated in 2004 with a master's in mass communication. She made many friends on this highly international program. Uh, while outside the university, she enjoyed part-time jobs, including one in a post office and another in a sandwich factory. These encounters with the people of Leicester were enriching experiences, and she retains happy memories of the university and the city. She applies her postgraduate skills as a vice president at a world-leading media corporation, but it is for her achievements in television and film that we honor her today. After her MA, Constance embarked on a career as an actor in Los Angeles, soon appearing regularly in popular TV shows and on stage. Her early upbringing in Cameroon had an endowed her with a love of storytelling, and this inspired her to want to create her own films, particularly stories that transcend the boundaries of culture, nationhood, and language. In 2015, she co-produced and starred in a much-lauded independent film, Ben and Ara, uh, for which she received an African Movie Academy Award, often referred to as the African Oscars, and the Best Actress Award from the Bronze Film uh, Festival. The film itself received a string of honors. It told of a devout black Muslim woman from African descent who is studying at an American university and falls in love with a white non-Muslim man who is agnostic. The film explores sensitively the escalating tensions raised by such a relationship. Audiences across the world continue to admire the film, finding that it connects movingly with their own experiences. In 2018, Constance was delighted to win a part in the Marvel film Black Panther, one of the most successful movies of all time, in which she played one of the uh, Dora Milja female warrior bodyguard of the King of Wakanda. The film, the film has made African culture and strong African female roles part of cinematic mainstream. The spectacular martial arts performance by the actors and uh, in, in The Bodyguard was honored with the Screen Actors Guild Award for the Best Stunt Ensemble, an award which Constance is particularly proud. She has spoken how art should bridge divisions, and this aspiration has informed her work. In 2000, 2015, she starred in Alexander Bedira's film uh, the Zim, about a white settler defending his farm during land sieges in Zimbabwe. Recently, she has produced and starred in another film, The German King, which tells of a historical Cameroonian monarch who resisted German rule. Currently, she is working with the doyen of Ni Nigerian British directors, Nagozi Onwura, on a film called Neighborhood Alert, which tells of a Nigerian woman and her son in America who find they are the only non-white people in a locality and their efforts to establish a connection with their neighbors. Constance's acting and production skills are, wide, well, are widely recognized as the source of much of these films' emotional power. Her crea creativity is grounded in her own family and in her experiences moving between continents and cultures. The ancient Greeks and Romans knew Cameroon as the almost mythical destination of sailing voyages around West Africa to a land of volcanoes. In the British media, we hear little about Cameroon beyond its renowned footballers. One reason storytelling is important to Constance is that the modern history of Cameroon continues to shape the lives of its people. Colonial rule by three powers has left a, a, a polarized legacy that periodically flares up into violence. She has put her acting skills to effective use in a one-act play, Ghost Town, 
and her exceptional vocal artistry in a new series of podcasts in which she explores the causes and development of the so-called Anglophone crisis. Only by understanding our history, she believes, can we move forward. Constance has come a long way since the sandwich factory and the post office in Leicester, but she is far from having fulfilled her ambitions. One of her main aims is to get Hollywood to tell great African stories from an African perspective, examining history to allow us to enjoy the cultural riches of the continent. In all her work, she has been uh, 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 she, she has been an inspiring role by the way she told powerful stories, breaking down boundaries, believing in the value of, of her contribution, and refusing to be discouraged. She is, the first, she is the university's first ever graduate from Cameroon, and indeed, the first from Wakanda. Mr. President and Vice Chancellor, on the recommendation of the Senate and Council, I present Constance Esunge Ejuma, that you may confer upon her the honorary degrees of Doctor of Letters. Good morning, class of 2022. What an incredible honor it is to be here receiving this award. When I was a student at this university almost 20 years ago, I never in my wildest dreams imagined this moment coming to pass. To tell you the truth, I still don't believe it. After I graduated with a bachelor's degree in theater, my mother mandated that I go to grad school and pursue a field that was a bit more marketable. This, of course, was her way of saying I should pursue a field that was more practical and would allow me to earn a living in the real world. I'm sure this sounds familiar to many of you here. So I set my sights on schools in the UK and chose Leicester because it seemed to satisfy two of my requirements a diverse and international student body, as well as a postgraduate program my mother would approve of. The idea of a communications degree being an improvement from theater to me seemed dubious at best, but I came here nonetheless and graduated with honors. Then came the difficult part, finding a place for myself in the workforce, which proved to be just as challenging as my mother had predicted. There was no roadmap which laid out how I was going to apply the things I'd learned in academia to the real world. In fact, I toiled in the first few years following graduation, doing a number of odd jobs and feeling like I had no sense of direction. I was starting to suspect that my education had been a complete waste of time. But I was certain about three things. One, I wanted to be a successful actress. Two, I had no intention of living up to the cultural expectation that I become a doctor, lawyer, or engineer, something many of us from immigrant families grapple with. And three, in order to grow, I had to move away from everything I was familiar with. I've been where you find yourselves right now, uncertain about the future and your ability to shape it. I find myself here today because of an act of bravery I made two years after completing my studies at Leicester. I packed my bags and moved from Washington, D.C., where I grew up, to Los Angeles, where I knew no one. And though my decision was driven by a desire to pursue an acting career, I did nothing related to Hollywood for several years because I had to prioritize my survival money, shelter, transportation, sustenance, finding community, you know, all the boring stuff. My determination to make it fueled me, and my ability to be open-minded led me down a career path I never expected. My first real job in Los Angeles introduced me to the digital marketing industry, a world I knew nothing about, but which was really taking off around the time I started working in the field. 
I had no ambition to become a techpreneur. Yet I found that I enjoyed the field of digital marketing and was able to excel to the point where I currently hold the title of Vice President of Search Engine Optimization at one of the top media companies in the United States. But my success in the corporate world isn't what motivates me to get out of bed every morning. Storytelling is. And while the notion of being a starving actor did not appeal to me, I refused to give up on my dreams. So I've had two careers my entire adult life, one in the corporate realm and the other in the creative realm. The education I received from this institution has been relevant to both. As it turns out, my mass communications degree from Leicester didn't go to waste after all. I communicate with the masses on a daily basis, from making sure that the millions of users who visit websites for brands like Billboard, Rolling Stone, The Hollywood Reporter, and a dozen others have a seamless experience consuming news content, to performing in films like Black Panther, a global phenomenon watched by millions across the globe. Despite where I've ended up, I'm still striving for growth and improvement. There's so much more I want to accomplish. I'm still learning new things, still figuring out how to live the best life. I don't think that ever ends. But I'm grateful to Leicester University for playing a pivotal role in my journey. And I congratulate you all on making it this far. Be bold, be brave, and even when you falter, know that you can redetermine to do better from this moment forward. Thank you. President and Vice-Chancellor, on behalf of the College of Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities, I, Professor Krista Kalman, present the following candidates for their degrees. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in American Studies with a year abroad, Alex Riley. Congratulations, Alex. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Contemporary History, Neve Powell. Congratulations, Neve. Well done. Joseph Smith. Congratulations, Joseph. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in History, Jessica Amaoko Achiampong. Congratulations, Jessica. Well done. Giorgio Anzalone. Well done, Giorgio. Zoe Erz. Congratulations, Zoe. Well done. Alice Bennett. Congratulations, well done. Natasha Beswick. Congratulations, well done. Uvase Bissanya. Well done, congratulations. Joseph Brown. Well done, Joseph, congratulations. Tori Brooke Campbell. Congratulations, Tori, well done. Mira Chauhan. Congratulations, Mary, well done. Lucas Christou. Well done, Lucas. Congratulations. Elizabeth Crossley Smith. Well done, Elizabeth. Congratulations. Lotta Dana. 
Well done, Lord Pete, congratulations. Sarah Edgson. Well done, Sarah, congratulations. Josie Fowler. Well done, Josie, congratulations. Georgia Holmes. Well done, Georgia, congratulations. Isabel Humphreys. Well done, Isabel. Congratulations. Alex Hearn. Well done, Alex. Congratulations. Madeleine King. Well done, Madeleine. Congratulations. Jessica Lello. Well done, Jessica, congratulations. Alexander Lloyd Williams. Congratulations. Habiba Mahmood. Congratulations. Jack Marston. Congratulations, Jack, well done. Ellie Middleton. Well done, congratulations, Elle. Kieran Murphy. Well done, Kieran, congratulations. William Murray. Well done, William, congratulations. Natasha Myers. Well done, Natasha. Congratulations. Kira Oldham. Well done, Kira. Congratulations. Robert Pratt. Congratulations, Robert. Jude Shirley. Congratulations, Jude. Katie Simkin. Congratulations, Katie. Alfie Stevenson. Well done, Alfie. Congratulations. Logan Turner. Well done, congratulations. Emily Warrender. Well done, Emily. Congratulations. Sean Whitford. Well done, Sean. Congratulations. Keris Williams. Congratulations. Well done. And Carl Wilson. Congratulations, Paul. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in History and American Studies, Esther Brown. Congratulations, Esther, well done. Elliot Copley. Congratulations, Elliot. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in History and Politics, Leanne Azante Abouadji. Congratulations, Leanne. Well done. Jack Aspie. Congratulations, Jack. Well done. Brooklyn Chan. Well done, Brooklyn. Congratulations. Ryan Devonside. Well done, Roy. Congratulations. Rebecca Evans. Well done, Rebecca. Congratulations. Scarlett Fennell. Congratulations, Scarlett. Well done. Louis Harvey. Congratulations, Louis. Sarah Hewitt. Congratulations, Sarah. Annabelle Hopwood. Well, there we go. Congratulations. 
William Horn. Congratulations, William. Sita Mystery. Well done, Sita. Congratulations. Andrew Murray. Well done, Andrew. Congratulations. Rory Simmons. Well done, Rory. Congratulations. Just can't well sing. Congratulations, well done. <laughs> Jonathan Stanbridge. Well done, Jonathan. Congratulations. Adam State. Well done, congratulations. Dorian Thomas. Congratulations, Dorian. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in International Relations, Audrey Adioti. Congratulations, Audrey. Well done. <laughs> Anwar Asin. Congratulations. You're going to follow that, are you? <laughs> Yassine Belkadi. Congratulations, well done. <laughs> Daniel Bilson. Congratulations, Daniel, well done. Eloise Brooks. Congratulations, well done. Amy Dixon. Well done, Amy, congratulations. Lookman Farah. Congratulations, Lookman, well done. Georgia Gandhi. Congratulations, Georgia, well done. Favour Irene Henshaw. Congratulations, Phil. Well done. Oscar Holden. Congratulations, Oscar. Well done. Priya Jahal. Congratulations, Priya. Well done. Megan Jones. Well done, Megan. Congratulations. Nicoletta Krasteva. <laughs> Carolina Lopez Feria Cavallo. Congratulations, Carolina. Well done. Sid McGlynn. Congratulations, Sid. Well done. Alexander Morrison. Well done, Alexander. Congratulations. Thomas Olivo. Well done, Jonathan. Congratulations. Leila O'Sullivan. Well done. Congratulations. Emily O'Wa. Congratulations, Emily. Well done. Situ Tan U. Congratulations, well done. Jamie Watson. Congratulations, Jamie. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in International Relations and History, Michael Ainsworth. Congratulations, Michael. Well done. James Bashford. Congratulations, Jim. Well done. Thomas Brown. Well done, Thomas. Congratulations. 
Aitan Farrell. Well, that's congratulations, Aitan. Siona Haria. Congratulations, Siona. Well done. Ibrahim Mia. Congratulations, Ibrahim. Well done. Rukaya Nanababa. Congratulations. Charlie Roper. Congratulations, Charlie. Well done. And Dilan Ucha. Congratulations, Dilan. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Politics, Kieran Adams. Congratulations, Kieran. Well done. Fletcher Burton. Well done, congratulations. Iona Gorn. Congratulations, Anna. well done. Kieran McCaffrey. Congratulations, Kieran, well done. Louis Miller. Well done, Louis, congratulations. And Nada Musa. Congratulations, now. well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Politics and Economics, Muhid Abdul. Well done, Muhid, congratulations. Simran Bart. Congratulations, Simran, well done. Tabitha Humiston. Well done, Tabitha. Congratulations. Damilola Jayola. Congratulations, Damilola. Well done. Leora Landgraf. Congratulations, Leora. Well done. Max Newman. Congratulations, Max. Well done. Israel Owalabi. Well done, Israel. Congratulations. Jack Richards. Well done, Jack. Congratulations. Oscar Swan. Congratulations, Oscar. Congratulations. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Politics and International Relations, Opiemi Adegurin. Well done, congratulations. Sebastian Barnes. Well done, Sebastian. Caitlin Davis. Congratulations, Caitlin. Well done. Thomas Gill Collier. Well done, Thomas. Congratulations. Jasmine Hamid Ali. Well done, Jasmine. Congratulations. Abigail Hamilton. Congratulations, Abigail. Olivia Holloway. Congratulations, Olivia. Teacher Jane Gray. Congratulations, Peter. Well done. Lauren Knight. Congratulations, Lauren. Well done. Andre Monk. Congratulations. Well done. Yvette Weiser. Congratulations, Yvette. Well done. Maria Nunez White. Congratulations, Maria. Well done. Ethan Norman. Well done, Ethan. Congratulations. Kevin Ose. (laughs) 
you want to shake hands? That's all right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Georgina Parks. Congratulations, Georgina. Well done. Amprin Roll. Congratulations. Leah Rangel. Congratulations, Leah. Well done. Archie Robinson. Congratulations, Archie. Well done. Aisha Robinson. Congratulations, Aisha. Well done. Chloe Samuels. Well done, Chloe. Congratulations. Alexa Talbot. Well done, Alexa. Congratulations. Cameron Bursey. Well done, Cameron. Congratulations. Cameron Walsh. Well done, Cameron. Congratulations. Lorraine Warinda. Well done, Lorraine. Congratulations. Tristan Watson Brown. Congratulations, Tristan. Well done. Chloe Woolley. Congratulations, Chloe. Well done. Matthew Wrigley. Congratulations, Matthew. Well done. And Khadija Youssef. Congratulations, well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Politics and International Relations with a Year Abroad, Megan Johnson. Congratulations, Megan. Well done. For the degree of Bachelor of Arts in Politics and Sociology, Lydia Admasu. Congratulations, Lydia. Well done. Matthew Cooper. Congratulations, Matthew. Well done. Hannah Hansen. Well done, Anna. Congratulations. Laura McIntosh. Well done, Laura. Congratulations. And Benjamin Smith. Well done, Benjamin. Congratulations. For the degree of Bachelor of Laws in Law, Hamza Allen. Congratulations, Hamza. Well done. For the degree of Master of Science in Financial Risk Management, Abdul Rahman Amaragbi. Congratulations, Abdul Rahman. Well done. Thank you. For the Postgraduate Certificate in Education Secondary, Monique Chana. Well done, Monique. Congratulations. For the Certificate of Higher Education in Politics and Economics, Ore Akin Molaya. Well done, Ore. Congratulations. And for the degree of Doctor of Philosophy, Emmeline Ledgerwood. Well done, Emily. Many congratulations. Nick Farmer, Liberation Officer of the Students' Union, will now address the congregation. Hello, everyone. First of all, congratulations. You made it. Graduation is about a lot of things. 
the rite of passage, joining the alumni community, reuniting with friends and courtsmates. And it's also a chance to say thank you to those who supported you along the way. Your lecturers and tutors, family, friends, loved ones, whether they're sat in the audience or unable to be with us today for any reason, I can guarantee they're all so proud of the work and effort you've put in and are so glad they were able to see you cross that stage. It's about remembering the moments that brought you here, from film nights and accommodation to sunbathing in Victoria Park, hours spent studying in the library or the tower, late nights and early mornings at Les Disco, asking a mate to scan you into a lecture, absolutely destroying DMU at Varsity, rinsing Freshers' Fair for freebies, even in your final year, trying to suddenly figure out teams, or even worse, Blackboard Collaborate, and coming up with your own ways to celebrate finishing your degree with back garden and campus photo shoots and ceremonies on Zoom. These are all the moments of your university life that have built a foundation of good times to go forward with, somewhere that you'll always be able to call home. Most importantly, though, today is all about you. It's about pausing and really celebrating your achievements, the hours of work you dedicated to your degree, actually finishing and receiving your certificate. You should be so incredibly proud of yourselves and take that pride forward as you become alumni and officially graduates, ready to go out and face the world and smash it. Once again, congratulations and enjoy the sunshine. Hello, everyone. First and foremost, I would like to offer my warmest congratulations to those of you who are graduating today. You entered this hall as graduates, and now you'll be leaving as graduates of this university. It has truly been a privilege to stand here today and congratulate you upon your success. Each one of you, along with your loved ones supporting you today, and those watching online, as a reason to be proud and celebrate. This is a momentous day in your lives, a day of achievement and celebration, but also a day of transition as you head off in new directions and explore new opportunities. Cast your minds back to the time you came to Leicester and reflect upon how far you've come. It is, by all accounts, a remarkable journey that has transformed you. You have been enriched through your times here by your education, by your experiences, and the knowledge that you've gained. But you have made new friendships, acquired new skills and knowledge, and you've gained much more than a degree. The richness of your experience will provide for you, support you for your future, and helping you to grow further and flourish. In the next phase of your lives, you will use the skills you have acquired and your talent to make an impact and be citizens of change. Individuals will go on to have a beneficial impact upon our society. As you heard from Constance, the future of work is changing, but you have the qualities employers are looking for, like problem solving, critical thinking, creativity, innovation, and leadership. The past few years have challenged you and tested you, but you have succeeded and now well equipped to face the future with confidence. I would like you to leave here as ambassadors of University of Leicester and carry with you our values. Be inclusive, be inspiring, and be impactful. So commit yourselves to become true citizens of change who help and empower others. As you make your way in life, I would like to share three things with you. Firstly, be ambitious. You're capable of far more than you realize. 
Today is the launch pad for your future success. Continue to strive for excellence and never settle for second best or mediocrity. Safe choices will lead to mediocrity. Bold choices can be risky, but they lead to brilliance. The late Sir Terry Pratchett said once, stories of imagination tend to upset those without one. I'm sure your experience at Leicester over the past few years will help you to forge your own bold, imaginative life story. Secondly, be curious. Life never stops teaching us lessons. Keep that quest for knowledge alive as you acquire new skills and learn new things. Today does not mark the culmination of your learning. It represents a new beginning. And finally, be kind. Our humanity is defined by our compassion. We cannot make progress as a society unless that progress is real for everyone. We're only as strong as those who are weakest in our society. You never know where or who and where a helping hand will come from in the future. So treat others like you would like to be treated. You're now in a privileged position, holding a degree from a world-leading university. You will have opportunities to advance your career, and in doing so, help others along the way. The measure of your success is not simply what you achieve for ourselves, but the good we do for others. This is beautifully captured in our university motto, Ut Vitam Habeant, so that they may have life. Now I would like to invite my colleagues on the platform and all the guests here in this room to show our appreciation on the achievements of our graduates. And can I now ask you, the class of 2022, to show your, show your appreciation for all our academic and professional services staff in this university, as, a, as well as your loved run, friends and families, those who are here and those watching online or elsewhere, who have been part of your journey. Thank you. Today is about joy and celebration. Have a fantastic time. Keep in touch with Lester. You have a friend, a friend in us for the life. As I come to the close, I want to leave you with the words of Maya Angelou to reflect on. She said, I encourage you to live with life. Be courageous, adventurous. Give us a tomorrow more than we deserve. Thank you. <laughs> Graduates and guests, please be upstanding for the final time in the celebration. Now I would like to ask everyone to make some noise and give a big round of applause for our class of 2022. Thank you. I now declare this congregation closed.
Oops. Please, can everyone remain standing while the academic procession leaves the hall? Graduates, you will then receive your certificates. Thank you.